Hello students, welcome back to World of Home Science. In the previous video, we have dealt with balanced diet for infancy, preschool years, school age children and adolescents. In this video, we will continue with balanced diet for adult group, pregnant women, lactating women and elderly people. Myself, Vijay Upatil, Assistant Professor of Home Science, Government First Grade College, Ankola. Balanced diet for adults that is starting from 19 years to till 60 years. Adults need balanced diet for being physically active and healthy. They have to maintain ideal body weight to prevent or delay the onset of chronic diet related diseases such as diabetes, cardiovascular diseases etc. Dietary guidelines for adult group. It includes foods from all food groups in the daily diet match food intake with physical activity. Inclusion of eggs and seafoods enhances the quality of diet. Vegetarians can derive almost all the nutrients from diets consisting of cereals, pulses, vegetables, fruits and milk-based diets. Eat plenty of vegetables and fruits. Ensure moderate use of edible oils and animal foods and very less use of ghee or butter or vanaspati. Overeating should be avoided to prevent overweight and obesity. Adults have to consume nutrient-dense, low-fat and protein-rich foods. Use salt in moderation and or restrict salt intake to minimum. Adults should minimize the use of processed foods rich in salt, sugar and fats. Exercise regularly and be physically active to maintain ideal body weight. Practice right cooking methods and healthy eating habits and they should drink plenty of water. Let's see balanced diet for pregnant and lactating women. Pregnancy is a demanding physiological state. Additional foods are required to improve pregnancy weight gain and birth weight of infants. The daily diet for a woman should contain as additional 350 calories, additional 0.5 grams of protein during first trimester. 6.9 grams of protein during second trimester and additional of 22.7 grams of protein during third trimester of pregnancy is required. Some micronutrients are specially required in extra amounts during these physiological periods. Folic acid should be taken throughout the pregnancy. It reduces the risk of congenital malformations and increases the birth weight. The mother as well as the growing fetus needs iron to meet the high demands of erythropoiesis that is RBC formation. Calcium is essential for proper formation of bones and teeth of the infant, for the secretion of breast milk and to prevent osteoporosis in the mother. Iodine intake ensures proper mental health of the growing fetus and infant. Vitamin A is required during lactation to improve child survival. Besides these, nutrients like vitamin B and C need to be taken by the lactating mother. Adequate intake of a nutritious diet is reflected in optimal weight gain during pregnancy that is 10 kg by the expectant woman. The pregnant or lactating women should eat a wide variety of foods to make sure that her own nutritional needs as well as those of her growing fetus are met. There is no particular need to modify the usual dietary pattern. However, the quantity and frequency of usage of the different foods should be increased. Maximum amount that is 60% of energy can be derived from cereals and millets. Cooking oil is a concentrated source of both energy and polyunsaturated fatty acids and can be included in the diet. Good quality protein is derived from milk, fish, meat, poultry and eggs. For vegetarians, a proper combination of cereals, pulses and nuts also provides the adequate amount of protein. Mineral and vitamin requirements are met by consuming a variety of seasonal vegetables, particularly green leafy vegetables milk and fresh fruits. 
fermented and sprouted grams and fruits rich in vitamin C such as citrus fruits can be included to improve the quality of the diet. Milk is the best source of calcium and hence can be included in the various forms. Foods rich in fiber around 25 grams per 1000 kilocalories like whole grain, cereals, pulses and vegetables have to be consumed to avoid constipation. Plenty of fluids should be included that is 8 to 12 glasses of water per day. Smoking and tobacco chewing and consumption of alcohol should be avoided. Wrong food beliefs and taboos should be avoided during pregnancy or lactation period. Balanced diet for elderly that is above 60 years. As people grow older, they tend to become physiologically less active and therefore need fewer calories. The elderly need nutrient foods rich in calcium, micronutrients and fiber. Dietary guidelines during old age. Food intake should match with the physical activity. The daily intake of oil should not exceed 20 grams. Use of ghee, butter and coconut oil should be avoided. Foods rich in protein such as pulses, milk, egg white, etc. should be included. Apart from cereals and pulses, a daily intake of at least 200 to 300 ml of milk and milk products and 400 grams of vegetables and fruit is necessary. Inclusion of fruits and vegetables in the diet improves the quality of the diet and bowel function. Flesh foods and eggs add to the quality of the diet. The diet needs to be well cooked, soft with less salt, oil and spices. Small quantities of food should be consumed at more frequent intervals and adequate water should be consumed to avoid dehydration. That's for now. This is me Vijaya signing off. If you find the content of this video useful, do like, share and subscribe. Comment for your suggestions. For future home science videos, stay tuned. Bye-bye.